Hello everyone, Satan here with Torn Tutorials with a new player guide. The purpose of this guide is to walk you through reaching level 15. Once you reach level 15, you'll want to watch my tutorial covering the early game. First, you're going to want to sell losses to players in the forums to make some money. The rate should be 300 to 400k per loss. You can choose any form, but if you're looking for recommendations, I recommend Losses Are Us. The link is in the video description. If you go through them, post on their form and let them know I sent you to them. The first thing you should be looking at buying with your loss money from the item market is Xanax. Your goal should be to always have five in your inventory. Xanax gives you more energy, which is great for making money and getting stronger. Xanax is the most important item in the game. Xanax basically makes you progress through the game. A good goal to have is to take two Xanax per day. Xanax is also the reason why it is important to reach level 15 as soon as possible because it unlocks rehabilitation, which removes drug addiction. Once you have some money in Xanax, you'll want to store the remaining money so you don't get mugged. There's lots of ways, but I think the best way starting off is to join a faction and store money in the faction vault. You'll simply go here and donate the amount, then ask your leader or co-leader once you want to withdraw your balance. Another great way is to go to the points market and buy 25 points, then buy a stock ticker. If you decide to buy donator status with real money, I'd also recommend using points to refill your energy for selling losses. Once you have a stock ticker, you can buy stocks and store your money. When you need your money, just sell your stock. There is a tiny fee though, and you could lose a little bit of money. Then the next step I would say is renting a castle. They're dirt cheap and will expand how much happy you have. Starting off happy is very important for getting stronger. Now that you have a castle, what you'll want to do is to look for a faction. In particular, you want a faction with an armory with experienced guns, combat armor, diamond blade knives, or makanas, and tons of booster perks and gem perks. These will help you get stronger, and the sooner you get in a good faction, the better. My my faction particularly accepts new players, so if you want to join, our doors are open for you. After you've joined a faction, you'll want to do happy jumps at the gym. To do a happy jump, you'll need anywhere from 49 to 100 boxes of chocolate, depending on your booster perks from your faction. Then you'll need one Xanax and one Ecstasy. Those can all be found in the item market. The last thing you need is 25 points for an energy refill, and that can be found in the points market. If you join a new player friendly faction like mine you'll only need to buy Xanax and the points for an energy refill everything else will be found in the faction armory for free now once you have all these items together you'll want to wait until you have a full energy bar once you have a full energy bar you'll take a Xanax then you'll wait until your drug cooldown is over when your drug cooldown is over make sure you check what time it is in torn you want to begin a happy jump at the 1 16 31 or 46 minute mark. This is because happy resets at the 0, 15, 30, and 45 minute mark. Then once the time is right, you'll eat as much candy as possible until it says your booster cooldown is max. Then you'll consume an ecstasy to double your happy. Then you'll train each of your stats evenly until you have no energy left. Then you'll use a points refill and then train all your stats evenly again. Your number one goal should be to do this every time your booster cooldown expires. After you've done one jump, you should be strong enough to attack a lot of people on Baldur list to level up. You can also find a link to Baldur's list in the video description. If your faction is like mine and offers EXP boosting guns, make sure you finish your foe with it in order to get bonus experience. When you finish them, select the leave option. This will give you the most experience. If you're having trouble winning against people on Baldur's list, try doing one more happy jump and trying again. Starting off, your job selection is really limited, but I'd recommend starting off in the army. You want to use your job points to boost your strength and to rank up in the army. If Crimes 2.0 has been released by now, you'll want to start off by doing 30 searches for cash on the ground. You can pick any option. After doing that, do the three nerf crime and select the last option. Every time you fail this crime, do 30 searches for cash on the ground again. Once you reach 150 bootlegging crimes, go to theft and steal jacket. As you play the game, there is milestones that give you merits. Think of merits as points to spend on a specialization for your character. For now, all you need to know is your first 55 merits should be spent on education time reduction. Speaking of education, when you select your first education course, make sure you select the sports science route. You want to do all these first. Lastly, be sure to like, comment, and share. I host daily hangouts in my Discord Discord server, so feel free to join. Link is in the video description. If you feel I have earned your subscription, please subscribe. If you wish to support the channel, I have a Patreon in the video description. 